let's take the first steps for adding content to a course. Select the course and add a module. Whenever you see a plus sign in Canvas, that means you can add something. This course is organized by weeks, so let's add a module called Week 1, Introduction and Learning Styles, and then click Add Module. This module isn't published yet. That's what the circle with the slash means. You need to publish the module for students to be able to see it. You also need to publish the course to make it visible to students. So let's change our course status to Published. Now let's add content to the module. We want a description of what students will be doing during this week. You may be tempted to think of this as an assignment, but it isn't. Assignments are things that the student is going to turn into us. In a non-computer course, this description of the week's activities would be a handout. So in Canvas, we want to add a page. And we'll click New Page and give the page a name. Week 1 Goals. The indentation lets you give your module contents an outline format, but we won't use that here. Let's add the page and now select the page by clicking its title and then edit it. Whenever you see the pencil icon in Canvas, it means you can edit something. We'll fill in the content in this mini word processor area. I'm editing out all the typing so that you don't have to sit through it. Let's make our first line a heading and let's take the items here and make them a bulleted list. Then save the work. We have two choices, save and save and publish. Save is a good option while you're constructing your content. Save and publish is the one to use when you're ready to let students see the page. Let's do that. And this is what the page looks like. We can also return to Modules and see that we have our published module and the page within it also published. Now it's your turn. Go to your course, add a module, publish it, publish the course, add a new page, edit the page content, and save and publish it.